Now, I'm going to put you on the spot a little bit as a coach and as a guy, since we're guys. What do women athletes do better, and maybe what do they do worse than male athletes in your travels? Okay. However you want to interpret that one, because I think the audience a, would it, like to know that one. It's, it's a fair question. Okay. I tell our players all, all the time, they'll, they'll, they'll ask me, what's the difference? You played. And what, what I try to explain to them is this. In men's basketball, in men's athletics, men in general, we can dislike each other mm-hmm. and not, I mean, really have a dislike for each other. But when we step onto the floor or the field, we're trying to win, you know, so it mm-hmm. doesn't matter. Like we're going to go out there, we're going to play together. Okay. We're going to figure out a way to try to win. Now, after that game, if we're on the way back to the dorm and you're in your car and it's pouring down rain and there's a flat tire, you're trying to get out and change it. I'm not helping you. I'm going to honk and, and go by and, and you know it. Right. And it's not a problem. You know, women, we have to have a, a, a good feeling about each other. Our team chemistry mm-hmm. is so, so important. Okay. And that's not just on the floor, but that's off the floor. Okay. Because there's more feelings involved. And, and there's nothing wrong with that. Right. And as no, a coach, I'm aware different. of that. And they ask me what the difference is. And to me, that's what it is. You know, I've seen it in, in years that I've coached in teams mm-hmm. where, you know, some of them, they might not have a like for each other, and they won't pass the ball to each other. Oh, wow. And they'll be like, I didn't see them. I'm like, they're doing jumping jacks wide <laughs> open, and what do you mean you didn't they're see them? They're always going. So then you just find yeah. out what the, what, what the problem is. Right. And, and, and sometimes it's the smallest of things. So we really have embraced it here that we try to confront everything head on at the beginning instead of letting things fester. Okay. And I think that's why we've been able, able to have so, so much success here, because our kids genuinely care about each other. Mm-hmm. Are they best friends? No, you can't have 12, 13 best friends. Right. But you have to respect each other. And that's one thing that our women do here. They, they, they truly re- respect each other as people. That's cool.